Hello, greetings mga kaspacers natin out there. Magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. This is your kaspacer and space commander, Professor June Kahigal from the Bedan Society of Young Astronomers and Beda University, Manila. And I'm here right now to explain an important astronomical event that will happen on November 19, 2021. So on November 19, there will be a partial lunar eclipse. Yes, mga spacers, you heard me right. A partial lunar eclipse will darken the moon on November 19, 2021. And in most locations, they will see up to 97% of the moon slip into the Earth's umbral shadow. But unfortunately, most of that partial lunar eclipse will not be visible here in Manila. Now, allow me to explain that further using this table. So, as you could see, the penumbral eclipse of the moon will begin in the afternoon of November 19, around 2.02 in the afternoon. So, by that time, the moon is still below the horizon. So, the beginning of the penumbral lunar eclipse will not be visible here in Manila. Then, the partial uh, lunar eclipse will begin at around 3.18 in the afternoon. And still, the moon by that time is below the horizon. So, that uh, beginning of the partial lunar eclipse will not be visible here in Manila. Then, maximum partial lunar eclipse will occur at around 5.02 in the afternoon. And still, mga kaspacers, the moon is still below the horizon. Moonrise here in Manila will be at around 5.25 in the afternoon. So, by the time, patapos na po yung partial lunar eclipse. But you can still witness the uh, partial lunar eclipse. Kaya lang patapos na po if you are high, let's say on top of a building with no obstructions whatsoever, you can still take pictures of the moon. Or pag nasa open field kayo with no trees, no obstructions whatsoever, you can still take pictures of the moon. Kaya lang po patapos na po yung uh, partial lunar eclipse at that time, around 5.30, 5.45 in the afternoon, around 6 o'clock uh, in the evening. Yan, makikita pa rin yung partial lunar eclipse, kaya lang patapos na po. And the partial lunar eclipse will end at around 6.47 in the evening. And yes, kita na po dito yan sa Manila. The penumbral eclipse of the moon will end at around 8.03 in the evening. And yes, kita na rin yan dito sa Manila. So mga kaspacers, so let's try to simulate this partial lunar eclipse that will occur on November 19 using this computer simulation called Stellarium. Okay, so uh, we have set the Stellarium on November 19 and let's take a look what will happen on November 19 during that partial lunar eclipse. Alright, so here we can see the moon rising above the horizon. Again, this is Manila, Philippines. And if you will notice, time check is about 5.25 in the afternoon. So by that time, the uh, partial lunar eclipse Uh, is over. The maximum eclipse is over. Alright. So, ayan po yung ating moonrise at around 5.25 in the afternoon. So, patapos na po yung partial lunar eclipse. So, at 5.25 in the afternoon, the moon is just above the horizon. But still, mga kaspacers, you can take pictures of the moon. Kita nyo pa yung red, reddish coloration ng moon. Uh, if you are in an open field like this with no trees or no obstructions whatsoever or you are high on top of a building yan makikita nyo po yan and you can still be fascinated by the beauty of that partial lunar eclipse okay so uh, in our simulation this is now 5.45 in the afternoon uh, padilim na and if you will notice yan patapos na po yung 
partial lunar eclipse. Yan, we can see now uh, the uh, dark portion of the moon getting smaller. Alright, so that's uh, 5.45 in the afternoon. So talagang patapos na po yung lunar eclipse. But still, again, you can take pictures of the moon. Medyo mababa pa rin siya sa horizon. If you are on top of a building, yan, kitang-kita na yan. Or if you are in an open field with no trees or no obstructions whatsoever, yan, makikita nyo, you can take pictures of the moon and be fascinated by that beauty of that partial lunar eclipse. Alright, we are now speeding up the time. Ayan, para makita nyo po ano yung mangyayari. So, you can see now, yan, palitan ng palit yung uh, shadow ng moon. Uh, that this is now 6 o'clock in the evening. Yan, halos kalahati na po yung uh, dark portion ng moon. So, talagang patapos na po yung lunar eclipse. Alright, but again, still, you can take pictures. Medyo mataas na siya sa horizon by that time. Alright, and if you will notice, yan, uh, time check. This is about 6. Uh, 6.40. Alright, so halos uh, wala na yung uh, shadow na nasa moon. Alright, this is around 6.50 in the evening. Alright, so we can see now the uh, penumbral lunar eclipse. Nasa penumbral shadow na yung moon natin. And katabi niya yung Pleiades star cluster. Yan, kitang kita po yung Pleiades star cluster. Halos magkatabi lang sila ng ating uh, newly eclipsed moon. Alright. Okay, so makikita niyo po yung parang grocery na constellation. Uh, that's the Pleiades star cluster. Halos magkatabi po sila ng newly eclipsed moon. But again, the moon is in the penumbral shadow of the Earth. Alright. So that's the uh, lunar eclipse, partial lunar eclipse on November 19. 2021. Again, still, you can take pictures of the moon. Kaya lang, pag nag-picture taking po tayo ng moon, eh, patapos na po yung uh, maximum lunar eclipse. So, yan po yung mangyayari on November 19, 2021. So, check out our Facebook page, the uh, Bed and Society of Young Astronomers, for more details and probably we'll be conducting a virtual telescope viewing at around 6 o'clock or 6.30. So kahit patapos na po yung lunar eclipse, kahit penumbral lunar eclipse na lang, we will still conduct a public telescope viewing uh, again if the sky will permit us. Alright, so thank you for watching this uh, short video. This is your spacer and space commander, Professor June Kahigaw saying live long and prosper. Maraming salamat and uh, please uh, watch and uh, let's uh, witness that partial lunar clip on November 19, 2021. See you all guys and join us as we reach for the stars.